So now in this video, we're going to look at an option for using one of these portable power supplies commonly used for recharging your cell phone or other USB devices to power an electronic circuit. So electronic circuits commonly work with 5 volts for a number of reasons and the uh, USB is 5 volts. So it's pretty nice. This particular one has 4 on there. You can just get a USB, this is the male version, to alligator clip adapter right there and we just got to uh, plug it in and we are all set so we will uh, zoom in and I'll show you how I have this set up so one of the things I do when I have uh, alligator clips that I want to work with the breadboard is just take these uh, wires here these are commonly available in uh, most kits electronics kits these uh, jumper to jumpers a lot of kits will have a little breadboard too I like getting the uh, better breadboard cost more but uh, it lasts almost forever so your circuits are going to work a lot longer and you're not going to have to replace it so we just clip that and we got the display coming on so I think a lot of breadboards or a lot of uh, power supplies I mean will not work like this I don't know about a lot but I think I have at least one where it didn't work it didn't want to power this little bit of uh, current so there we got it we have our circuit powered right there so that's just clipping to one of these jumper wires pretty straightforward there's also I don't know what you would call these but uh, they're just a little piece of metal so there's a long strip of them I just snipped it with uh, some metal snips right there and uh, the longer one goes in there you can just connect to them directly so now I think that the power turned off so we had I don't know maybe a minute of power I'm guessing you can just hit the power button and it all turn back on again right there and we are at a hundred percent so we can just also clip directly to these if you have these that's what I normally do with my power supply right there it'll power them so we can get rid of those jumper wires they're just in the way just clip to those which are already in the breadboard I have those uh, wires going across to connect uh, red to red and then uh, blue to blue up there so that both rails are powered but uh, there you can see we have a working circuit, 5 volts from the supply, and this is going to last a real long time. This is hardly using any uh, current compared to, say, a cell phone. There you go. That may have been about a minute again. we got to hit the power. So, in any case, that's a powering option. And uh, so, hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out one of the other ones that I'm posting. Click like, subscribe, the bell, all that. Donate to Patreon if you can. That helps out the most, but just watching as many videos as you can helps out a ton. Thanks to everybody that does that. I will see you in the next video.